Welcome to the Banner Saga. Saga. Sa- of the sagas. I'm Weavy. I've met you guys before. We're just gonna let this scroll. Let's go. Gods are dead. In their wake, man and giant survived through a tenuous alliance, driving back destroyers called Dredge deep into the northern wastes. Now is an era of growth and trade. Life goes on. Only one thing has stopped. The sun. <sighs> that ain't natural. Nope. So we've def- we've played this game before, mm-hmm. and if you've already seen some of the other playthroughs that uh, the rest of us are doing, then you kind of understand what, we've- what we're doing. This is our playthrough. Um, like I said, we played through the game before, and this time we're just going to try and make everyone as happy as we possibly can. We're going to help people out. Even help. if they're suspicious. <laughs> We're gonna help everybody. Everybody gets everything they want. So, been a long several months on the road. The first signs of snowfall cost us on our approach to Strand. Uh, is there voiceover on this? And I'm just reading over the voiceover. I'm not entirely sure, but you know, everybody's seen this before, right? Yeah, a couple times. Yeah. You know. I think there is, and I was just reading over it. Cause now I hear it. So one of my favorite things about this game is that while they're doing all of this exposition, oh, there's totally a voiceover. Yeah, and it's not like <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Um, but when they're doing the all this exposition, they're showing you this beautiful landscape. So it's not like you're just sitting there reading giant chunks of text. Yeah, you get to just admire the admire, gorgeous artwork <laughs> seriously admire the artwork kind of get a feel for how vast everything is and how small everything else is in comparison oh yeah this looks like norway so i was recently in norway and <laughs> now i'm looking at this and I'm like this looks like it yep the fjords and the mountains and the snow and uh it's cool gives it a whole new context one of my regulars got to go to Reykjavik, Iceland, to oh. go see the Northern Lights. Oh. Like a jerk. Reykjavik sounds awesome. Iceland sounds awesome, in general. <laughs> Look how much bigger these guys are than the humans. Yeah, because they're fucking giants, man. I know, I just love seeing them next to each other. Oh man, here we go. Eh? Oh, hey. <laughs> yes. We are here to destroy. I'm just so enthralled with everything else. I have nothing else. I can't even focus. Oh my god, it's so exciting! Alright, this is where we learn how to battle. I'm not gonna lie, this is probably where I'm the worst. Yeah, me too. It's been a while. Alright. These portraits show the order of initiative. Taking turns left to right. Yup. Movement happens before action. Some characters fill more tiles. Yeah, cause he fucking huge. Cause he giant. All right, yep. all right. Cool. Go forward. Forward and onward to victory. Yup, yup, yup. Just murder him dead. You can choose to attack the strength or armor. That's going to be important. Yep. So his strength is a little higher than his armor. Yep. Armor blocks damage, but can be reduced by a break attack. Yep. Okay. I'm not going to do that. So then you just double click on the fist. You did. He's down! <laughs> now we get some experience. Probably my... Another thing that I really appreciate about this game is that it's... The tutorial is really... Ha, teaches you everything you need to know about it. And then oh, as yeah. it continues on, that's where tactics come into play. And that's where it's just a lot of trial and error. But... Mm-hmm. It's not so bad. Special abilities. Well, that's the thing. It's even simple. Like, it... There's a lot... To learn, I guess, but it's it's not complex, and you can pick it up really quickly. There's not like a million stats to worry about. Last one standing. Which is doubly nice. Which has always been my problem with a lot of oh. tactics games before, is that it's all about min maxing. You gotta. Oh, you, yeah. it wants me to. Yeah, because otherwise you can't do it. Bow. Kachoo! 
Um, where it's just like all this min-maxing, it's like, okay, well you're just gonna like do all of the levels and get all of the job classes so you can have 99s and everything, and that's just... It's too much. It's not like This is a little bit more... A little simpler. You have a little bit more control over who levels up when, who you want to use more than others. Watch the chaos that mm -hmm. follow. Watch so man pretty. and bar slaughter each other. Even before I love when games Already give you like they well in this one they gave another. quite a bit of background into going in uh but of the history before the game started, but now it's about the most important thing that's happening to them right now. It's not the history and the story of you're not playing through and losing the sun, you're not playing through the great war, you're Experiencing the aftermath. Mm -hmm. that, that part of the story too, where it's it was on the banner behind him, it reminded me of the beginning of Wind Waker, where they're telling no! the history. I'm a terrible gamer. I've never played any of the Zelda games. Oh. I'm the worst. I'm the worst. This is movies. That's right. I got nothing. <laughs> You've been slowly working through them. Slowly, but very, very slowly, but surely. They will meet you down in the Ah, uh, yes, down in the proving grounds. What are we to do? Only the sun has stopped. Because <laughs> the world goes on. I like it. Nice chapter name. I prove. You're a pro. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> You're a pro. <laughs> You're approached by a familiar man who walks in step with you as you're leaving the Great Hall. He cuts to the chase. Yup. I appreciate that. I like it. He's awesome. Ubin, isn't it? Alright. I think- It is! Everything <laughs> you're is so coming. nice. Oh, yeah. I love this guy. Oh, he's great. He's just like the old scholar man. Mm. Probably what did you have in mind? Yeah. I'm just like, hey, you tell me what you need, man. I got your back. Got your back. We're here for you. Whoops. Should we be reading this? I don't know if eh. this is voiced either. I never talk over any of this. People know how. Is there anything left to worry about? I know who can tell us. Dun dun dun. Is his name, his name Eric or Eric? Because there's another I in there. We're even learning how to go places. Yes. Maybe Eric? Eric? I think Eric? it's just Eric. All those extra. Open face houses and eroded stalls. What do we got? I'm not in the mood I love today. this man. Hat. Look at that hat! Look at the beard! Beautiful! He's so great. Oh, come on. <laughs> The chieftain oh. bled, out, bled out about an hour ago. Yes. <laughs> That's this roll. All right, let's see. They don't talk to me. Liar! Do you need some help? I'll be. I'll be good. <laughs> no, Ubin's, no, we're gonna be super nice. Ubin's got this. He's just gonna give him Swan's some visibly fumbling with some dirty trinkets on his table. Wait, just buy one of these. If everyone thinks I'm getting worked over every week, how am I supposed to know much? By not being so goosey. Pay him? Yeah, well, yeah. We just... we're nice. <laughs> Look at you with surprise. <laughs> Take whatever you like. The only thing I'd like is the name of a place. Got it. <laughs> Skulks away with a wave of Eric's hand. Bodyguard. Who's our bodyguard for this one? Yeah! Oh, I <laughs> love Ganolf. Yeah, he's pretty epic. I think he frequently dies. Were you wearing but I was able black to. at the Great Hall? <laughs> <laughs> they look good. They look nice. You look good, buddy. <laughs> I'm glad we, you care. <laughs> we do care. We do care, Ganolf. <laughs> Alright. Well, I think we have our next objective. We just got a bunch of dialogue to see what's going on, but uh, let's just uh, continue on in the next episode. Alright. Alright. 
see you in the archives. See you in the archives.